Oh, hey. What's going on? We're cleaning out the blue car and everything is falling apart. Because sun has been eating away at all this shit. Look, these, these boxes are just like, they, they got no integrity. I'm thinking about selling the blue beast here, so I'm gonna take care of the headliner here right now. I don't know if this is just gonna all fall down like gross, but So anyway, there's, there's a lot of shit, but uh, it's still insurable. I do need to get some air in the tires, especially the rears are flat as fuck. Like I think one of those, one of those tires is completely ruined, but if I can get the air up, uh, I'll probably drive it up to mom's, park it outside the garage or back it inside the garage if I have to. Um, but I gotta jack it up and get those uh, wheels off and get some roller tires on. I think the fronts will be fine once I get some newer air in. I don't think I've started this car this year and it's already September, so... Oh, fuck, it's not gonna turn anyway. It's got no battery in it. Shit. Okay, so I got more to do. I gotta charge up that battery or put it back in. Um, Technically, I could pull the battery out of the 66, put it in here. Twenty seventeen was the last uh, insured date. No, that's the current one. I also thought about taking off the uh, vacuum gauge here and putting it in the 66. I kind of like having a vacuum gauge. All right, I'll go get the air. Grab the battery. And uh, I'll be back. I originally had all kinds of things I was going to do to this. Obviously, the biggest one was to take the engine out, put it in the uh, 66. Uh, but I have since bought another slant, and also there's a guy up the road who says he'll basically give me one that's already out. So that removes the hassle of taking this one out and it leaves this car sellable. So that's what I think I'm gonna do. Maybe I'll try to drive this up there with the tires fucked and uh, we'll do the inflation up there. Let's see. I don't know if this, this battery probably doesn't have enough. No. Yeah, it's gonna need a charge. What was I using that for? Oh, it was long. I was using that battery to uh, light off the rockets. Probably only lit off eight or ten, and it doesn't obviously take much of uh, take much to uh, catch fire. But uh, yeah, well, that's unfortunate. Yeah, last time we had a neutral safety switch thing too, so I remember I had to be a neutral. Oh, 
I'm a little surprised it won't uh, Yeah, I'm a little surprised it won't try to turn, but yeah, it could be stone dead. All right, well, this experiment is uh, rapidly turning into a bunch of nonsense. Uh, just, I'm gonna go take the battery to 66, I'll be right back. I see the wasps have made a nest in here as well. I like that. Oh, I see the fuel gauge coming up. Oh, Jesus. Gas pedal's not returning. Got our action back. Oh, I'm not seeing the fuel gauge go up anymore either. Fuck. I might as well just leave that up. Something up with the uh, park position, neutral safety. Last time that problem cleared itself out. When I was all done, I just put it back into park and started it again. So I don't really know what's up with that. start right now anyway that's gonna take a bit of work sorry for the uh, failure on the awesome but uh, I will bring you with me next time I'm doing this I'm still serious about getting it uh, well into a runnable state getting some rolling wheels on it and sell it like I say I wasn't gonna sell it as a whole I was gonna kind of part it out and uh, I even had some thoughts of taking the whole front end off and like put it on top of my container there just for coolness but uh, that's a lot of work for no reason and it would be harder to get out of here when it's half apart so anyway I think I will sell it as a uh, absolute beater and uh, yeah I mean I'll see you soon I, I yeah I thought we were gonna have a little bit more excitement there eventually but it looks like it needs more than uh i got it up to charge the reds battery now i can't go anywhere in the valley anyway uh yeah i'll bring it back have a good one take care bye